You're doing cheese? Yeah. Okay, come here, bring it to me. Oh, I'm gonna break my nails with this. Why? Why break your nail? I break my nail because I'm gonna use not a um I'm not gonna use scissors for this. Guys, I'm I'm literally just trying to eat my gyozo with my soy sauce. And she wants to open this now. Alright, GB. I got this for like £10.50. Here, one second, let's just show the camera. I got it for £10.50 from um, Tesco's. And it basically, it's like a rabbit. Cheese! And cheese, yeah, and it's got babies. It's basically a pregnant rabbit. So, we'll see what this is. Cheese! Cheese! One sec. Put it here, put it here so people can see. <gasps> What's inside the tummy? <gasps> Is there something inside the tummy? Let me see, let me see. Come bring it here, bring it here. <gasps> oh. <gasps> What's inside the tummy? <gasps> baby. Little baby! Look at that little baby. There's oh, another one. There's another one? Yeah. Oh, there's only one. Oh, well, that sucks. Do you want some gyoza, huh? Are you sure? No. Not even one? No. Na, 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 na. Okay, have you finished? Time for bed? No. Mama, you've got literally until I finish my gyoza. And then it's time's up. Let's go. Let's go. Mm. Let's go. Are we going to bed? Are we going to bed, Ava? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Yella. Hey guys, so I basically just got called now. I just woke up and that's a lie, I didn't just wake up, I'm working all night. What am I talking about? I just got a call from the BBC Asian Network to um, basically just feature on a conversation they're having this morning. So I thought in the, um, in the furtherance of me vlogging again, I thought let me just vlog it. Yes! I'm really not bothered to do it. I really hate picking up their call because I can't say no. And it's like, they say they call me and it's like half an hour to get ready. So I'm going to go charge my camera. So hopefully it will be charged by the time I do it. Bye. <laughs> Anna's fine. It's Anna with a TH, as I always tell people. Oh, okay, Tana. Yeah, I get that. Uh, so, Tana, you're a Muslim dating guru, right? Yeah. Is it off-putting if a man or woman is still at home, single, in their 30s? In your experience of the dating game, is there always a question, why are you in your 30s and still at home with your parents? I mean... As a blanket statement, I would say yes. However, there are extenuating circumstances. For instance, if there's a, a man who's, you know, staying at home only because he's trying to save up to, to, you know, get on the property ladder to kind of make himself independent, that wouldn't be that off-putting. If someone's just staying at home, just, 
you know, to save money or because they don't feel the need to, to go out and be independent, then yeah, that would be off-putting for me. Right, okay. Have you heard of this in your experience where people have said, well, I'm not going to marry this person because they're still living at home in their third? I mean, I do hear, it, like, girls, that they do judge it and they, it is an off-putting thing, but it's not the make or break. Obviously, like, once you oh, fall in okay. love with someone, it's a bit difficult to kind of move away from them just because of that life choice of theirs. But it is off-putting because I do understand, like, a lot of people, especially in the Asian culture, they end up living at home, you know, the, the, the in-law, the, with their in-laws. And what I've seen from a lot of that is that, you know, a lot of problems are caused in those situations. Yeah, I mean, uh, Afshay on Twitter said it's called looking after your parents and not just simply discarding them. No. Looking after our parents is what Asian people have always done and indeed is what all people want to describe to acquiring their modern way of thinking, which is to leave their parents to fend for themselves. Okay, I, I, wow. think, I think if, if you're of the mentality that just by moving into a different home you can no longer are no, are no longer capable of, of of helping your parents out i think you need to check yourself because there's no there's, i've moved out recently and i st i literally i see my mom almost every single day i facetime her if i'm not seeing her that day like it's not they're not they're not mutually exclusive like you can't be saying that people who decide to move out to become independent and more mature and have responsibilities of bills and you know all the things that come with moving out you can't say they don't care about their parents just because they're not staying at home see there's some interesting words tana that you used there about you know maturity <laughs> yeah. um, which has then this is what women might be thinking about you that you're immature mm, i don't i don't really think that's the case you know i think women are a lot more smarter and a lot more mature about the situation and to understand that if you can get there, why not? <laughs> well, I didn't say that the, the wife isn't supposed to help or anything like that. Like I said, it's one... Oh, sorry, sorry, it was on mute, <laughs> so I didn't over talk. Um, so, I, yeah, so um, I, I didn't say that you don't both kind of, you know, take part in the expenses of a household, because once you're married, it's a different situation. It's one money pot, as I did say. But just the knowledge that your husband is capable of, of kind of just, like, footing that bill of your lifestyle and, and you and your children, you as a family unit, that gives me more security and it would make me, res I'm not saying it, I would disrespect him if he was unable to, because obviously there are situations where people aren't able, are not able to, but it would make me respect him as a, a man and make me feel like, you know, he can look after me. And that in turn, I would, you know, do my part as his wife and I'd want to do it. I just think it causes tension, you know, within households, I don't. I don't see a lot of households where the the the, the wife is the main breadwinner and the the man is a uh, as a house husband and it's a good dynamic. I haven't seen that in front of me in all the instances. And that, that, and that maybe to do kind of with how women have been discriminated against in the workforce for many many years in the sense that you know women's career choices are impacted upon by having children, uh, discriminated against when they go back to work, and culture has dictated that. Men are the breadwinner. I mean, this goes back to caveman time. Yeah. Um, but, but things change. I mean, I know of women who earn much more than their husbands, and their husbands decided to stay at home, bring up the children, because it doesn't make financial sense. I mean, I'm just a bit old school in my mentality in that, in that you know, so the person raising, the, it's a mother's touch and a woman's touch to be raising the children. Absolutely, the husband should spend all the time, a lot of time with the kids, but just being raised by a mother, I think it's, it's really important. So whilst 50-50 is great, but having the husband be the main person raising and the woman is out for work, I just don't think, I personally, and it's my opinion, I don't personally think it's a healthy dynamic for, um, you know, a, a, a relationship or a marriage um, within okay. an Asian or Middle Eastern culture. I, I, I bring Susan in on this. Susan, will you listen to that? I'd like to know your thoughts. I know this is different. Okay, so I think they're on a the break. But yeah, what do you guys think? I think I went off tangent. I'm not even talking about that anymore. <laughs> But yeah, I just think it's, um, I, I know it's probably an old school, I thought maybe people were going to say, oh, it's double standards, why do you get to have an old school mentality with that, but not about living at home? Well, it's an old school mentality that I have, is that, you know, the, the man should be the brain, he should be capable of it. Whether you decide as a family unit that the woman's going to go out, and the man's going to stay at home for whatever circumstance, that's a different issue, but 
you should be capable of it. I should feel that my husband's capable of of allowing us to live a comfortable lifestyle. Or even not comfortable, but just allow us to live and have the basics, water, food, you know, roof over our heads. Hi guys, so continuing on for my vlog. I was gonna say vlog again. Um, I got, today I was, basically, I've had the worst week in the world ever, okay? So, long story short, okay, I recently fixed my car because the coolant was leaking. When I paid like shitloads amount to fix it and then all of a sudden yesterday I went to pick up Bay from the airport and it started leaking again. That's number one. Number two, my bathroom was leaking. So yesterday I had to fix that as well. Okay? Plumber came in and everything. Number two, no day before yesterday, sorry, and then yesterday my washing machine decided to stop working. So plumber just came in now to fix that too, like why would people even move out on their own, like, with their own free will, like, seriously? But I didn't even know these issues were even possible. Like, I was just casually, yesterday, going to, like, on my merry way to put a load in the washing machine, click on, and it doesn't switch on. But I'm really happy, because now they fixed my dishwasher, and I was going without a dishwasher because it wasn't working. I'm just, like, one of those really casual, like, laid-back tenants where, like, <laughs> things are just not working. Like, my hoover wasn't working, I just went and bought a new one. Like, my dishwasher wasn't working, I just started washing dishes by hand, which was, like, a mission anyway, but... I'm just, like, easy. But then when she, they came to fix... When she brought a plumber to fix the, um, the washing machine, I thought, you know, might as well get my shit together and sort that out, too. So, that is sorted thankfully and and what else what else what else I don't know so anyway now I'm gonna finish my makeup and then I'm gonna show you guys my outfit of the day and oh and today what was I gonna say that the whole point of this snippet of my vlog was I was gonna tell you that I was invited to to go have afternoon tea um, by the cafe itself, so I'm gonna go and I'm really excited. Mm, mm, yeah, I'm gonna have to just like live off my shakes tomorrow and not eat meals, but I'm just so excited to say it's gonna be worth it, I know. Because I think I've heard good things about like the food here of this place. I'm taking my friend Ronisa because she's getting married soon and I thought it'd be nice to take her there. But yeah, so that's what I'm doing now. Um, I'm gonna finish my makeup and I get back this. I'm running late as usual. Bye! Hey guys, so I've just finished my makeup. Makeup on fleek. Like, oh my god. <laughs> just a bit of perfume. I've put this. Oh my god, it's almost finished. Does Arabian Oud want to get in touch again and hook me up? Because it's almost finished. Just saying. I don't know. Because I got this from them as a gift last time, so maybe you guys want to be generous again, I don't know, because it's kind of expensive, ain't gonna lie. And on top of that, I put, um, YSL Manifesto. And we're done! Oh, I'm gonna go show you my outfit now, so let's go do that, okay? Okay. Okay. Gotta do this situation here. Okay, let's see. socks on. Please bear with me while I put my socks on, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Pre-mark, six for a pound or something like that. Oh. So I'm wearing boots. And not this is information that is interesting to anyone, but I'm saying, you know, I just always when I wear boots, I put over my jeans. I usually forget to take it, them down below my jeans when I go to people's houses and I have to take my shoes off it's like, I look like a widow. But, oh well. Oh well. Okay. Let's go. Oh, uh, uh, uh. 
bit of a gum never hurt nobody. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. All right, let's go. Let's go. Me back. Let me take me back. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. So. I've opened all my windows because the guy cleared out my dishwasher and this was, from, this was like from before, not me, because I don't stink my shit, but the people from before me, like, stunk it up to a point that it was like, ugh, like it stopped working. The dishwasher was itchy. I stink so much, I feel sick of myself. I'm not even going to start cleaning anymore. I'm just going to stop cleaning. That's it. That's how bad it was. So, yeah. Okay, so, thing is, let me switch off the light, one sec. Thing is, I need to, realistically, I need to take all of this to the recycle. All of that. I need to take all of this to the post. All of this. So, how am I going to do this? I need to put my boots on as well. Where are my boots? Hold on, uh, sorry, where are my boots? They were right here. Oh my god, someone's stolen my boots. Can you think that's crazy, but so many people have been in and out fixing this house, like, lately. That is actually a very, very realistic thing that could happen. Hey guys, okay, so this is my outfit. I am so obsessed. It's like military style, high, low top. And then my oversized over the knee boots. These are from New Look recently, they're in the sale actually. This is the, this polo underneath, it's like long sleeve, is the polo, the Rania polo from Modest by T. This is the commando dressed, dressed, dressed by Modest by T. You can see it's long at the back, short at the top. And this scarf, this came in, if you can see it, it's like, oh, oh I don't know. I'm turn that would make more sense, yes. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like, it's like black glitter, um, and that's called Marissa, and it's by Modest by Tia. I think it comes with four colours, I think, black being one of them, so yeah. That is my outfit, okay, I don't know what, I just showed you that mess over there for, but yeah. This is my, yes, yes. It's really freaking flowering, can I just say? Just tucks you in, right where you need to be tucked in, so it covers the... Good old belly. Oh yes. All right, I'm gonna go now because I'm running super late as usual. But check back in the hour. Oh yeah, I should put music. Hey guys, so I'm. I've just dropped. I dropped my mail. I <laughs> went mail. Like M A L E. Like I dropped my mail. Like I'm gonna pick my mail up because I miss it. Jokes, no. Um, I dropped my post and. No, and I dropped my car to the mechanics and now I'm with my lovely friend who's Hi getting guys. married. She's getting married. She's getting married. Yeah, 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 yeah. No get week. it, get it, oh get God. it, get it. She's getting married in India. I'm so sad I'm not gonna go. So sad. The only thing I'm happy about is I'm not gonna have diarrhea. That's the only thing. <laughs> Imagine me on my wedding day and I get oh diarrhea. No, you'll be fine. Oh, no, but no, but you won't be fine actually, because probably because you're used to the water and everything here. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. Do you get? No. We'll, we'll it's in India, it by the way. If you're wondering. We'll about figure it out. I'll let yeah. you know. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for that. I would love to go there. Dun, 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 New Delhi. Touchdown. Anyway. Mumbai. Um, oh. Oh, is it? What is this man doing? Is it two lanes? So, there is two names. So, now I told you guys that I'm on my way, we got invited to Fate Maison. The Salon de Thé. The Salon of the Tea. Where's that? Where's my phone? Okay, I could have just done that for you, but okay. What did I just drop, please? Okay. Um, so, we're off on our way there. So, I can't wait. Off. Don't hate me. Mm. But, this is not for this. Basically, okay, bye. Bye, we'll see you again. <laughs> <laughs> bye, bye. Hi guys, we just arrived. She's just doing work and I'm just waiting for my food. So we're just waiting for our food. 
I can't wait. I'm going to eat today's my day off. My day off from my diet. And um, best believe I'm going to try to work. Yes. And meanwhile, she's still doing work. Hi, do you want to give me some attention, please? Thank you. Hi, guys. How do you feel about getting married? I'm really excited. Are you? Yeah. Yeah, it's fine. Like, I was like, I was like, you're like, negative. You can't. I just want to be married too again. <laughs> Well, this is my first time. <laughs> Third time lucky for me, Anthony. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm really excited. But I'm nervous as well, so I'm going to see. Are you? Yeah. I just want everything to like, just go to plan. It'll be fine. Like, she's like OTT, like OCD, OTT. Like, everything O. <laughs> I just organized. like things organized. <laughs> like on a different level. Like even down to like the, the smallest detail. I thought I was bad, but I'm not at all nothing compared to you. I just very good with so. I didn't think I was this bad. I'm, I know I'm really bad like this when it comes to my business, but for the wedding, I've just gone yeah, crazy. So bad. So, but you organized everything. Anyways, we'll come back again when our food comes. Because that's I'm so hungry. Pierre, 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 Grab a snack first. I really want it. <laughs> I really want it. She's looking at all the students right now. Everything is just. Go ahead. How about you show the food? Show this. And the table looks amazing. Like amazing. First of all, do you know what? I love this mirror that's behind that. It's beautiful. And then look at the chandelier. If I show you the food. I love chandeliers. Pictures of us. Got <laughs> <laughs> oh, so anything to say, Fana? You guys didn't even know how excited I am to inhale this table. Long okay. I'm really fucking yeah. excited. Let's get this picture done. Mm -hmm. And um, then we'll go to the stairs. Can you move yourself from the mirror? I'm just going to take some of them no, move it away. Can you see me? Can you see me? No, I'm trying not to see you. I want just the table. <laughs> Is it showing us? Just me. Mm -hmm. You have them. I might need some. This was not sugar. Sugar? Yeah, it's not sugar. It's not sugar. I'm 
başka özellik var. Bir de çıktı molaşta. Give me a second. I don't find everything. She's in toilet, I think. Oh, okay. Maybe she's in toilet because I don't find everything. Never mind. Just finished. See you guys at the table. The moment we literally inhaled that table. She didn't so much. I just inhaled it. We're just waiting because basically we parked a bit too far and we got an Uber. Sorry. We got an Uber and the Uber's outside. But we just want to say bye to the lady that hosted us. Her name is Huda. She's really lovely. Hey guys, so we're gonna go. The lovely, Hi, the lovely manager. Manager, manager, yes. manager, manager. How lovely is she? She's so pretty. Not as pretty as no, but really pretty. Really Hi, pretty. guys. I um, hope you both had an amazing time, and uh, hopefully, I'll see all of you beautiful. You really, people. you guys really have to come here and try that food. <laughs> He's amazing, and their food I've tried before for Ramadan. It is on point. Okay, but we have a wide selection of other amazing options. They have a loan. You need to come back and make sure you try with us. Yeah. So, and hopefully, we'll see all of you guys. You guys have to come, okay? All right, say bye bye. 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 It's just basically round the corner if you turn your car around and found? it's just straight. Yes, it's just straight down and we have to take a right. Cool. Did you put this information on? The other thing. The other, oh. other thing as well, yeah. Oh, you just said you take a right. So you go straight. Is it somewhere else? Uh, no, it's straight as in on the other side straight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. We're so lazy. We're so worried. worried. Because if you don't come, it will cancel automatically. I know. Oh. That's why you started they it, right? Six pounds. Yeah, I know. Thank oh, you so I'm much. Counting every moment. Oh. <laughs> Thank and you so I much. I was watching five minutes, few seconds. I said, I uh, no more time. I have to start. Uh, yeah, no, no, it's Soon fine. I start, then you jump in. <laughs> it's just straight on, yeah. and you have to take a right. I'll tell you when. Sure. Doing some uh, work or something? Yeah, we were just working, vlogging, vlogging. Yeah, we can oh, see yeah, yeah. It's here. I remember us walking straight here. From here. What? So then where's my car? No, I'm pretty sure it's this one. Oh, it could be this one actually. Yeah, it's this one. Mm. Queen something terrace, because that's yeah. the one that was on the parking. Yeah, we parked this. Right there, yeah. It's right there. So if you just do U-turn, it's right there. How lazy are we We're going to go back to our parked car. Oh, so just here. Just black car, yeah. This one, yeah. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank you so much. You have a great time. Thank you, you too. too. Sorry for the delay. It's okay. Thank you. Bye bye. Take Have care. a nice day. Thank you too. Bye bye. Okay, five stars for you. I Thank you. Thank you. you. Thank you. <laughs> trying to, trying to get his five stars, bro. <laughs> of course, you're gonna give me five stars. I think it's so stupid that they're doing it for customers. What? Yeah, so we, can, we can't even um, oh. read it. Can we not? No, I, I always ask them to show me. Oh, is it? Yeah. What's your what ring? Say, I've had one bad when I had actually um, booked an Uber for someone else and they'd misbehaved in the Uber. How did they, they were a bit drunk. Oh, shit. Yeah. Anyway, we are back, back home. The thing is, we had loads of amazing goodies. It was really nice food. It was lovely food. I love the hummus. The hummus is amazing. Everything was amazing, like really. But I think we OD'd on chocolate. Mm. I think I need something savoury now. Why are you looking at me like that? So I don't think I should eat anymore. But we need to eat like... Like what? Put your seatbelt on. Okay. Let me put some music on. Let me put some music on. Hey, 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 hey. Alright, we'll catch 
back up with you guys. We catch back up, yeah. <laughs> we catch back up. Please oh, don't yeah. judge my English. Please don't. <sighs> it's the idea of chocolate. Oh my, oh my god. god. I love, I love, look, I guess I love it when babies uh, like that. I, I want I twins really just for that purpose, but I don't want them after that. I want After twins. they come, leave the pram, I don't want them. I don't want no, no twins. I just wanted twins just to put them on top of each other and that's it. <laughs> and then, someone could just go look after them. And that would be great. So, um, yeah. What are we gonna do? I just wanna find the place of the sushi if that's okay. Wasabi, any wasabi on the way? And we're gonna pass Westfield, right? I don't know. Just well, yeah, stop. we passed it on the way, on the way here. Mm. So, we'll, I'll just run down and get something. Do you want wasabi? I don't know. Store. Do you know what it is? Wasabi is this thick, the pain in my ass because it's yeah, not everyone's near. Everyone's just copying that. Yeah, everyone's everyone's putting it's flowers a bit everywhere. Too much now, right? Yeah, there's everyone flowers the everywhere. Peggy Portion started it. Now there's flowers everywhere. Like every shop, even the local chicken shop, is about to I start putting flowers. I think I need to do it at the salon. Just put I shit loads of the salon. Um, I was about to say you should have like a flower wall. Yeah, wall. Yeah. Honestly, you should do it. Let's do it. Do you know, like, I, I've always thought of it, and I'm like, you know what? We could do it so cheaply. Not cheaply, but like, you just buy a bunch of fake flowers from China. Mm. You know, those plastic flowers. Mm. You just fill the entire wall for it. Because yeah, those cheap flowers are ugly to have in a vase, but those cheap flowers are okay when you fill the entire wall with them. Mm. Good idea, I think. Yeah, honestly. Wagamama? No. No, because these are all things that are in our ends. Do you get it? Mm. Do you get what I mean? Just go go home and I'll find something on the way. Mm. Have you been to that cement story? Sarai. No, I actually haven't. Turkish place. No, I used to work in this one. In Whole Foods? Yeah. No, no way. In this, um, what was this, what is this place called? South Kensington. No, yeah, I know, but what was it's this place called? It's Renouche, we could have had Renouche. I used to come there for lunch. What is it? Renouche, yeah. Mm. Mm. Today's cheat day, so I might as well just eat everything on, except for the kitchen. Straight yeah. <laughs> I can't forget, I will never forget that face. I'm so glad we got it on camera. Oh, good. Did it a different. Look how, look how dry my lips are, please. There's also here. There's actually, there, there, it's right there. How crazy, we don't park there, it's park, park on the left. How crazy, guys. I just thought Get out of my there. car. Get out of my car now. 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 Get out yeah. Keep it right next to you. Oh my god, don't panic me like this. Made a shisha and we've got our cokes and we're no, that's Muslim right there shaking capsules for for Rena. But yeah, I really hope I don't show in the reflection of the TV fuck. No, I actually can't be asked to even edit it even if I am, but oh well. Bye! Say bye. Bye. Your nose is running because you're ill, Mama. So Ava's home now. I am Ill. What? I am Ill. You're ill because you were, you didn't wear enough clothes. You didn't wear enough clothes. What? And it was cold and you didn't wear enough clothes. That's why. Why? I don't know why. Next time you have to wear your coat. Okay? I want a star. I should get a star. You want to get a star? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, where from where? The star? Yeah. Okay. There you go. There's a star. 
Can you go to sleep? Yeah. Come on, let's switch off the light. Okay, what story do you want? Um, Layla. Hmm? Layla with Bib? Yeah. Okay. Yalla, let's switch off the light. Switch off the light. Hi guys, so basically I was filming, as you can see I've got my scarf on and my makeup on, I was filming my video, which should probably be up by now, and um, and I needed, and I arrived midway, so now I'm going to put her to sleep before I continue the video, I don't even remember where I put it, where I left it, but yeah I'm going to go now because you guys can't see shit, I look like the ring. Um, so yeah, so I'm going to go and I'm going to read her story, put her to sleep, and then I will be back with you guys. You're like poltergeist. Mama, is it my, is it my, Mama? Hi, Mama. Is it my, is it my phone? Yeah, this is your phone. I'm using your phone. Why? Huh? Why? I'm using your phone. Because I'm just using it, because I can read you your story. Yalla. Say bye-bye. 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 Yes, I was filming, and... I had to put Ava to sleep. Ava, stop. And, um, and then she didn't go to sleep. So I brought her to my bed. And I thought, you know what, I'll sleep with her. And then I'll wake up. And continue working. That didn't happen. Um. Yeah, that's um, gonna happen. I stopped with my makeup and everything. I stopped doing that. So I ended up sleeping with her till the morning. And <gasps> wow. Ah, let me put some oil. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let me put some oil on you. I'm sorry, Mommy. So, yeah, so we woke up, I made her breakfast, and now I'm taking her to nursery. Um, yeah, I'm taking her to nursery. And that is that. And then I'm going to continue filming that godforsaken video. It looks like God doesn't want me to come up. Crazy, right? I'm not crazy. That should be me listening, but... Okay. I'm... Um, um, who are these moms that get their hair, like their children's hair symmetrical? Like, I want to meet you. Seriously, though. W no, I, I would be lucky if I've just got two pigtails. Like, forget them being in the same place. Like, one's hair and one's hair. I still happy. know my ABC. Now, Charlie, the LMNOP. LMNOP. I don't even know what order that was, but yay. Okay. What? Why are you talking with that? Why am I what? Why are you talking with that? Why am I doing what with that? Talking with that. Talking with what? Just that. I don't know what you're saying, mommy. What are you doing? I'm doing the fila. Like this, this one, and like this one, another one. Like this one? Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing it like this one, the other one. Let me just finish this one, and then I'll do the other one. It's nice little Vafira. So nice. And don't couple. You don't what? And don't want a couple. You don't want a couple? No. I don't really know what you don't want a couple of, but okay. I want to do like flat. Another one. You want like a plat? Yeah. Yeah, I'll do a plat now. I did, yeah, I'll do, I'll do that one a plat too, just wait. And down. Yeah, I'll do that one a plat too, just wait. No, no. Stop it, stop it, stop it. What's wrong? 
Slowly. No, slowly. Slowly. No, not on my laptop because you're going to ruin my laptop. Come on, let's go. Slowly. Let's go. No, no, don't, don't play with your hair, Mama. I just did it. Stop that. Okay. Come on, let's go. Let's go, say Mama bye, bro. Water. Mm. That's your bottle of water that you had last night. Yeah. Look, the wood in we're no more here, we're no more here. Because you drank it yesterday. This is my starlet. It's my thingy, her friends call starlet. Anyway, I'm going to drop but her. Butter water, butter water. It's here, it's here, it's here. This is the camera here. Oh, this is the camera here. This is the camera here. Down, 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 down. She is a no more. What? No more. No more what? No um, more, no more, no more. No. Little bit. No, no, little bit. Little bit, little bit. I'm little sorry, bit. no, you can't have it. Little bit, little bit. No. Little bit, oh, little no, bit. I'm sorry. Okay, fine. Just one. Just one. She wants a jelly. Hi guys. So I'm just working up. I just made the shoe shoe not Just try it. Out here trying to distress. Don't judge me. Um, I have basically this interview. It's a TV interview. Um, I'm not really going to say much about it until it airs. Because we all know with this evil eye shit is real. Um, not that I'm not saying that evil eyes give me evil eyes. Like, generally I give it to myself. But... As I said on my Instagram live, I've decided to start moving in silence, just like the fuck. So yeah, that's where we're at right now. So I can put Ellie so I can have a nice shisha and a nice cup of tea. A lot of people tell me to do a video on how I set up my shisha because I swear to God, guys, the reason I smoke so much is because my shisha tastes so good. Like, I've even stopped going out to smoke. My shisha tastes better than it does in the cafes. And when you're making shisha like that, you can't really... You can't really justify going out anymore, like, which is messed up because it's like, um, I don't know. But yeah, so, so today I'm going to the to do this video thing. It's set in a nail salon, which is kind of funny because I've done my nails, but I don't know, see how it's all so out, but. I'll try and vlog. I'm gonna ask if I can vlog and I'll try and vlog. I'll come back when I've done my face. Bye. Hi guys, okay, so I'm currently in the car on my way to the place where we're gonna be filming. I told you I was gonna be filming today. I'm gonna to tell you what for, and I won't tell you what for until it materializes. <laughs> but um, I'm here with India. Hi, hello. <laughs> Really safety and amazing <laughs> <laughs> We've had a really lovely chat in the car, but we're almost there. I'll try and vlog when I'm there, but I don't know again. I'll just see what I can do. But um, but I'll probably check in back again in a bit. Bye. Hi guys, so I couldn't really film inside. Oops, too, too close. Okay, so I couldn't really film inside. It's not airing yet. That's probably going to air later in. Um, 
I think it's eight pound probably is the time that they said for that. So I'll let you know when that's about to air. It's gonna be on channel four. But yeah, but anyway, that's what I was doing today. Um, now we're in this like local cafe in no, not and, so no, take take and, um, and then with India, yeah. and we're just basically yeah. oh, yeah, so much better. And now we're just going to basically get some food. I ordered poached eggs and um, avocado toast. Thank you. Um, but yeah, so we've just ordered food. We're gonna eat, and then I'm gonna get dropped off home, and then I'm gonna see. Jane, remember Jane. You'll see Jane later. So yeah, that is that. I will start coffee here. Yeah. I'll show you guys the food when it comes, and then I'll wave you to the loop. Okay, bye. Wrap the food. Yeah, which I find weird because I don't have that many followers. How many have you got? Um. Hi guys. Okay, so don't mind my really messy kitchen. <laughs> Like bizarre destroy, like actually. Um, I'm cooking, and usually when I cook, a bomb explodes in my kitchen, and then I clean it. Like, I don't clean as I go, which I probably should do. Um, I'm just making Ava some food because my dad, she spent the day with my dad. Um, so, I'm making her this lightly dusted cod nugget. I prefer these. Look, you can see them. They're actual pieces of fish over fish fingers. Um, and there I've got like, um, this is like a salad, let me try and show you guys. I mean, I mean look if you can see, it's got like pomegranate seeds in it and stuff. I love pomegranate seeds on everything, so yeah. Um, and then mozzarella, like or rather caprice, what is it called? Salad, caprice, caprice salad. But I just need to put the pesto on that and we're good to go. Um, and there's some like stir fried vegetables with quinoa. Quinoa, I said right, I was going to say quinoa. Quinoa. But yeah, um, so I shall ta check back in when she arrives, which is she's like a few minutes away anyway, so see you in a bit. I'm going to get you a surprise now, okay? Okay, so I'm going to get you a surprise now. Balls as well, and Ava's cup and her pink cutlery, and that's not a surprise yet. So they look at me like that. Okay, I'll tell you what the surprise is now. Okay. The surprise is this. Okay. It's bubble tea. No. What do you mean no? I don't like honey. Why do you, why don't you like it? Uh, why I don't it? like it. Okay, fine. If you if you I'm if, surprised you want another <laughs> You want another surprise? Yeah. Okay, let's eat and then I'll give you the surprise. If you eat, I'll give you a surprise. It's a nice one. It's a sweetie. Yeah? Okay, so I'll, 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 a piggy. Do you want a piggy? No. So if you eat, I will give you the surprise. Okay? Wow. Guys, don't judge the fact that I use plastic cutlery and papers for myself. Mama's vegetables. Do you want some vegetables with Mama? No. Look, it's so nice. No. Yeah, it doesn't look very nice, does it? As well, mm. So nice, look. What's this for? This is for your fish, maybe. No, for your cucumber. No, for my dish. Mm-hmm. I got it. 
I'm on Roy's party. Okay, here. Is it for chips? No, it's for the fish. Mmm, yum yum. Is it nice? Mmm, mm, yum yum. Mm. It's so nice, isn't it? Do you want some mozzarella party. cheese? Do you want some cheese? No, I want a watch party. Do you want some cheese? No, I want some more potty. I want some, um, some more potty. Mm hmm. When we mm. finish food, we'll have a word party. <laughs> Is it yum yum? Shall we call Bibi Bibi Bibi? Let's call her. I'm say hi, how are you? Because she called you earlier but you weren't here. Sleep now. Brush our teeth and go to sleep. Mm. 